Hello everyone and welcome to stage one of the kids division for the National Ninja League Season 7 World Championships. Before we get started with the rules for each individual obstacle, we're going to go over some general rules. I'm going to tell you what you can and cannot use for every single obstacle. If I don't say you can use something, you cannot use it. We're going to be going over touch points and landing platforms. Now, for a touch point, once you touch that touch point, you have cleared the previous obstacle. And for this course, every single landing platform is the start platform for the next obstacle, which means you must stay on it. You cannot overshoot. With that being said, let's jump into the rules for stage one. The first two obstacles are linked together. For obstacle one, you will use your hands and feet on all of these blue surfaces here. And your touch point is going to be this rope. You may use both hands and feet on the rope. And for obstacle two, from this rope, you will go across these blue handholds. Once again, blue only. You will share, make your way across until you can get to your ending platform, which is this blue box right here. Once again, you must stay on that platform. Demo. For obstacle three, you will use only your hands on these two trapeze bar, both sides of the propeller, this other trapeze bar, and the rope to make your way to this blue platform. This obstacle is hands only. Demo. Clear. Obstacle four, for, for this one, you will only use your hands on these blue wheels to traverse your way across until you can dismount onto this blue pad here. Clear. The next two obstacles are linked together. For obstacle five, you may use both hands and feet on the quad steps and the lily pads to get to your touch point, which is this rope right here. You may use both hands and feet on the rope. You will traverse your way up until you can grab this bar, which you will use to slide down and transition to your next set of holds. You may use your hands and feet on all three of them, the blue parts only, and your ending platform is this pad right here. Now, for your final obstacle, for this one, you will use your hands and feet only on the blue surfaces of our hazard swing here, and you will use hands only on the blue surfaces of these beams here. You will swing out, traverse your way across until you can dismount onto this pad and hit the buzzer. Now, athletes, it is your responsibility to hit the buzzer and to make sure it goes off. If you hit it and it doesn't go off and you fall off the platform, that is going to be a fail. So make sure you're pressing that buzzer and staying on the platform. Demo. And that is a clear of stage one.